guys, coming to you with a Saturday night bonus video. I had to squeeze this in before the 12 Days of Foundation kicks off tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. Eastern, which is super exciting, but I still have lots of holiday stuff to talk about, and it's gonna be too late by the end of the 12 days, so tonight I'm going to cap off my holiday gift guide slash just like quickly running through some potential options for you to give to yourself or to someone else. I will link part one down below, and similar to part one, this is also a giveaway, so as I'm going through the products, I will let you know what is up for grabs on your end. And if you're curious about this look, I did just film it. I used that um, sparkly shade from the Barbie palette that I was chatting about, but I may very well be editing this Instagram tutorial as you're watching this because I'm filming this on a Saturday night because 12 Days of Foundation holidays, it's a busy time of year, so <laughs> stay tuned for that. But let's go ahead and get started. One of the brands that I think does a killer job every holiday season is Fresh, and I love a lot of their skincare because a lot of skincare now is very heavy in, heavy in acids, active ingredients, and I need other things to pair with that type of skincare because I can't just like put a vitamin C and a salicylic acid and an AHA and a BHA like all on my face in one night. So you know how much I love their night cream, their black tea essence. So the first set actually has the black tea essence in there which is really exciting because it's a high-end product like their black tea line is one of the, the kind of more up there in price but it's gorgeous so in here you're getting the kombucha essence you get the black tea overnight mask which is really nice the black tea eye concentrate you get a ton like an eye concentrate you're only going to need a tiny bit the only thing in here that i haven't tried is the firming corset cream but i'm sure it's great because the black tea line is just amazing and then they're kind of i would say most popular line I guess would be the rose line and then their soy facial cleanser is their most popular product ever so this is a great set for that too it has the rose face cream in there which I think is great for all skin types the rose face mask is like really nice and cooling and lightly hydrating and then the deep hydration facial toner which I think is great for all skin types even if you are oily it's a nice way to add some hydration into your skin because it's super light uh, and I really like the packaging it's super cute looks like little windows and uh, yeah I think fresh always does a great job up next, I have one last thing to chat about from Fenty. I talked about their gloss set and uh, some of their other holiday offerings in my first video, but then they launched the Trophy Wife set, which I'm not totally sure if it's supposed to be for the holidays, like I'm assuming it is, but it didn't launch with all of their other holiday products. So I did use all of these on my face. Stay tuned for that. It's coming on Instagram. It's the look that I was wearing in Thursday's video, which was my favorites video, and I had actually never tried Trophy Wife. So I was excited to try it, when I used it in person, I did not like the way that it looked on my face, but in watching it in video, I thought it looked really good. So, I don't know. I really liked it on my eyes, on my face. I don't see myself reaching for it like on an everyday. And then the other products that they had in here, like this is not gonna be for everyone. It's very gold, it's very glittery, but it's still super, super fun and kind of like, if you're gonna do it any time of the year, it's gonna be the holidays. So you get the full-size Trophy Wife, then you're also getting this Trophy Wife Fairy Balm, which I thought gave a beautiful glow to the skin. I would prefer this over something like their uh, body glitter, the liquid ones. Then you're getting a gloss balm in gold, and there's quite a bit of gold in here. Again, this is not something that I would wear on its own, but layered lightly over a nude lipstick, I thought it was really, really pretty. Then you get the gold, Mademoiselle, which like it doesn't really have the texture of a Mademoiselle. It's just in the same packaging, but I wish that all the packaging was gold. I think it's so pretty, but again, very, very bold and glittery, not uncomfortable or chunky on the lips though, but you'll see it in that video. And then a gold eyeliner, which I used to kind of pat over the top of the trophy wipe that I put on my lid and I thought it gave a really gorgeous look. So I wouldn't use all of these together, but they're a really nice set. It also does come with a really nice black makeup bag that I think you could absolutely use again. I think I'm not sure what I did with that honestly I kind of forgot that this was a holiday set and right before I started filming this I was like oh right and I was going around collecting things I may have already given that to a friend just because I have so many holiday sets but it is a really really nice bag so if you have a friend who's super into gold or super into Fenty this is it a lot of very strong skincare holiday kits here today. This is probably one of my top picks for the holidays. It's one of my favorite brands and it is Laneige. So no surprise here that I'm going to be recommending this set, which is the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. So it is their Kiss Me at Midnight set. So you're getting the original lip mask, which is my favorite scent. And then they also have the mint chocolate scent and then the sweet candy. So you're getting two minis of those. So I love this lip sleeping mask. I know some of you do not like it. I cannot live without it. If I don't use this at night, I can 
feel it the next day and I think it's absolutely amazing and I think it's a great little set uh, and then the other set that I have from them is the uh, Water Wonderland and in here you're getting the water sleeping mask which is a really nice light overnight mask. You're getting the moisture cream which is a really beautiful moisturizer. If you have oily skin and you feel like it's going to be too heavy for a day which it's not that heavy but depending on how oily your skin is you could absolutely use it as a night cream which is what I do. Uh, and then you get the eye sleeping mask in here too. And then they have another set which they didn't send my way but it has the um, their new, oh my god, what is it called? Water cream? Or their new, like, kind of lotion-y moisturizing toner, which is, like, a really, really crazy good product as well. So that's another set to absolutely check out from them. And again, I really like what Laneige does at the holidays because they have, like, some fun products in here, but they have, you know, their fan favorites, and you can get them at a better price than if you were to buy them individually. So it's a great way if you are curious to check it out for yourself or... I feel like Laneige is like a brand that I recommend to a lot of people too because a lot of the time similar to Fresh I get people asking me recommendations for skincare in general like I need a good moisturizer so a lot of the time I recommend like a drugstore one like a Neutrogena Hydro Boost so I'm like or if you want to hop into Sephora Laneige because they have a good price and I feel like they're friendly to the majority of skin needs. So yeah, this is the first item that I'm going to be giving away because I love all of these products and I want you to uh, discover them for yourself too. Moving into some more makeup, I actually included all of these already in an Instagram tutorial, so a link to it down below if you want to see it in action. And I saw recently that these were on sale because they launched like a little while back. So they may still be on sale. I have not checked, but they are from Smashbox. So they launched a couple of different things. The first is their primer photo is their Photo Finish Star Power Primer Set. So you're getting the original primer in there, the Smooth and Blur, but the things that excite me the most are the Primer Water and the Primer Riser. So I think that these are really good because normally a set of three primers may not be that useful to the majority of people, but because these are all three very different primers and Smashbox is kind of known for their primers. I think it kind of makes sense. Uh, then you have this set of three different palettes in here. So you're getting uh, a highlighter, a bronzer, and a blush palette, which if you have any like skin that's any deeper than me, I don't think that is going to work for you, unfortunately. And then two of their cover shot eyeshadow palettes. I love their cover shot eyeshadow palettes. These are not minis or anything. These are full size products in here. They have the exact same quality as anything that you're going to buy in store, which I always appreciate because sometimes at the holidays, we know brands can skip out a little bit and things can be a little bit sketchy. Uh, and then you have the, the Divine Shine Gloss Trio and this has three full size lip glosses in here. To note, two of them do have shimmer in them. One is like this beautiful kind of nudie cream shade. I don't know that I would necessarily wear the kind of like ruby shimmery shade, but two of the three I really enjoy. And as always, that's going to be personal preference or, you know, if you want to give one to yourself, two to another person, you know, you can always, always split up a holiday set. For my curly girls out there, I know I would definitely appreciate seeing this under the tree. It is the Share the Curly Love set. There's a few different sets from Diva Curl. There's one for like light moisture, this is the medium moisture, and then there's like the heavier moisture one. So in here you're getting their kind of like most popular products, I guess I would say. The Diva Curl No Poo Original and the One Conditioner Original, those are both full-size products. And then also in here, you're getting the Set It Free, which is the Shine and Finish Spray, which I really, really like, and the Light Defining Gel. And I love getting minis of curly hair products, even though like I can put it into another container. There's something about having the actual product in the actual container because traveling with curly hair can be an absolute nightmare. So I love that they include these minis in here. And it's a pretty good deal, 48 dollars American and uh, 64 dollars Canadian so considering that Diva Curl is like a higher end brand I think that this is a really really good deal and absolutely useful if you have curly hair uh, this will not go to waste from the drugstore, I have some Physicians Formula, and they did a great job with their holiday stuff last year. They've actually relaunched the mini liquid lipsticks set that they had out last year, and I really, really like their liquid lipsticks, so that's something to keep an eye out for. They also have a set of minis of their Rose Skincare line, and I like a lot of that. I don't love the cleanser from the Rose Skincare line, but I like a lot of the other stuff, so that's something to look out for. The two products that I have, the first one is the one that I was the most excited to try out, so it's the Maru uh, Maru 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 Butter Brazilian Pout Lip Kit. So this has their limited edition lip sleeping mask and then three of their Maru Maru Butter uh, Lip Creams, which I had actually never tried these. I'm wearing one right now in the kind of more nudie peachy shade. I had initially planned on wearing this red one 
and I guess I was expecting it to feel more or less like a regular lipstick, maybe a little bit creamier, but wow, it almost melted on my lips when I was putting it on and kind of not in a good way, which is disappointing. I love this shade. It feels really, really creamy, but I can just tell that it's not going to stick around on my lips, and my apartment is like not particularly warm it feels almost like i left it in a car so that's kind of unfortunate um, but i haven't tried this lipstick formula before so let me know because i didn't see i saw a lot about them when they launched but i don't remember anyone's actual thoughts on the formula so if you've tried these let me know like i said i do really like the nude formula but the red one i was like whoa no this is just gonna melt all over my face <laughs> as for the lip sleeping mask i do really like it it's very clearly trying to be like a laneige style thing uh, and I do like it. I don't like it as much as my Laneige, but I do think it's a great option. And obviously it's going to be more affordable. And if you do happen to like these uh, lipstick formulas, then it's nice to get that bonus of something hydrating for the lips. And then also from Physicians Formula, they launched these little three pan palettes. I'm wearing the blush and highlighter from it today, uh, They have ex the, which is an exclusive shade. The bronzer in here is too light for me. There is a second palette though which I do not have so I can't say if that's going to be any deeper but the highlighter is in tropical sands uh, the bronzer is just in bronzer shade which I think is one of their existing bronzers because they have kind of weird names for the bronzers uh, and then the blush is in beachy peach which I believe is an existing blush but physicians formula is hypoallergenic dermatologist tested clean, um, cruelty free all that kind of good stuff so some of those things can be a little bit harder to find at the drugstore so if you can if you feel like these three shades are going to match you or somebody else the formula is great unfortunately uh, they they sent this to me so unfortunately the shade broke because the formula is a little bit soft if you're picking this up at the drugstore it shouldn't be a problem as I just feel like in the shipping process it took a bit of a beating but it's a really nice slim packaging it's got the magnet on there so it doesn't have that weird bulky packaging and I think it is uh, really nice so much good skincare to chat about today and I freaking love skincare minis so the next brand is Ula Henriksen again another brand that I love that I think does a killer job around the holidays and they have mini sets all year round, I'm pretty sure, which again, I really appreciate that. Uh, so the first, they have two little ones here in bags. So this is the Truth Be Toned skincare set with their Balancing Force Oil Control Toner and the Truth Serum. And what I like about this is it's items from two different lines. So normally when you get a kit, it's like all of their Truth line or all of their oil control line. But I love that they're including an oil control product and a brightening product because like those are two things that I look for. And I, I like to be able to mix it up. This one is more from the, the Truth line. So this has the Truth on the Glow cleansing cloths, and then it also has the Brightening Gel Cream, which I think is awesome. I love, love, love both of these. So these are gonna be ending up in the giveaway. If you are curious to check out these brands, both of these products are awesome. And like, I think for any skin type, they're gonna be good. I mean, if you have dry skin, you may not want the oil controlling toner, but overall, uh, especially the vitamin C line is really good. And then they have, this one is kind of, there we go, I shook them back in. So this comes with the full size truth serum, which is nice, a mini of the gel cream, a mini of the eye cream, which I love, and the mini banana bright primer. I really like all of these products. Uh, so it's fun that you're getting that full size truth serum in there. And then the other set is the ASAP kit, which is the as smooth as possible. The mini glow to o dark spot toner is amazing. Whether you or somebody you know has any dark spots on their skin, that's great. The retinol sleeping cream is really good and the serum is really good too. So this wouldn't necessarily be something that I would get for somebody that is like not as well versed in skincare. I would probably get them the OMG. But if you know someone who really loves skincare or you yourself are suffering from texture or dark spots, this is a great option. And the toner is so good. Like you'll see a difference before you even get halfway through the bottle. So really, really love these. And I'm going to go ahead and include this uh, ASAP kit in there because you're already getting the true serum and another kit. So I figured you can mix it up and give this line a try. I think Benefit always does a good solid job job at the holidays but what I will say is the kits year to year the packaging kind of changes but the offerings kind of stay the same and they don't launch a ton of new products that would be available to be put in new kits which I get but it just I don't know I would like to see them switch it up a little bit but that's not to say the products are bad so they have this mini of the little gimme brow which is a classic but we all know that I'm a fan of the 24-hour brow setter over the gimme brow so I think that this is really cute but I would love to see a mini of the 24-hour brow setter one if it doesn't already exist and then the theme of all of their um, stuff this year are kind of these mini caravan tins so depending on which one they're all different sizes and different prices which is great depending on your budget or your needs so this one 
one has a mini of the Gimme Brow, a mini of the uh, Bad Gal Bang, I was gonna say That Gal Bang, and the mini of the classic Porefessional. Then this one here, you're getting uh, full sizes of Hula and Roller Lash, which is awesome in there, and then a mini again of the Gimme Brow. And then you've got a, the biggest one in here has a full size of the Their Real, a mini high beam, full size Porefessional, and a full size Gimme Brow. So I think that those are fun. And then this is, I guess, a newer thing to them, but they launched this um, Babe On Board Bronzer, Blush, and highlight palette. I don't know if there's multiple of these, but the one that they sent me has Hoola, Rockabye, and Dandelion Twinkle. I can get away with using Twinkle. Um, sorry, I can get away with using Hoola and Rockabye. Not so much Twinkle is a little bit too light of a highlight. It really actually reminds me of like, this is kind of, I guess the physician's formula would be a dupe of this <laughs> essentially, but you know, it's just like a bronzer blush highlight palette. The colors are similar, uh, but I will include this in the giveaway just because I have all of these these things individually. The, I will also include this uh, biggest caravan as well. And I know like for me, I will never reuse these tins. Let me know if you would, but I find a lot of the time, I talked about this in my last video, when it comes with a tin and they're like, you can reuse it. It's highly unlikely I ever actually will. Uh, I'll be a cute, but like I don't, I don't see myself using this. Another brand that I think is always fun around the holidays, I think this is kind of a lot of the gold standards when it comes to holiday brands. A lot of these products do, or a lot of these brands do really, really good jobs with their holiday launches, but the body shop always has fun stuff. They always have like some kind of cause that the um, pro some of the proceeds are gonna be donated to. Last year and the year before they launched those headbands, which you see me wear those all the time. They're so good for like masking. If you have curly hair, if you just like, like wearing a headband, they're really, really comfortable. They have it this year, but it's in like a reindeer head headband, which like I don't think is as cute like I have a deer one and a bunny one that feels more all year versus like I don't there's a there's nothing wrong with wearing like antlers in July, but it's just, I don't know. I love the animal ears and I think that they should keep those around all year round. I think they, they were around for a long time, but then I know as I was trying to link to them when you guys were asking me about them, because I wear them literally every single day, it seems like they were becoming less and less available. So I would love to see those become permanent. So these are cute, but not like, as cute, I think, as the animal ears. Then I think this is a really great little set. Every year they have, I believe, three different kind of holiday scents. So this one, Rich Plum, Warm Vanilla, and Juicy Pear. And Juicy Pear just reminds me of Jelly Bellies. If you eat, have you ever eaten Jelly Bellies, Juicy Pear is my favorite flavor. It's so good. <laughs> so I was really excited to see with them, see them come out with a pear scent. It's not as like typical holiday last year they had some kind of more typical scents i think it was like a cranberry i think warm vanilla or some type of vanilla was in there um but the rich plum and juicy pear i think is really exciting and although it's three body butters it's three different scents i travel with these all the time or it's a good way to like try three different scents and their packaging is always really cute that you basically don't need to wrap it which is exactly like this guy there's a little bow that goes around it. They have a ton of holiday stuff. I'm only talking about a little bit. I will say though, every time I've gone to open this box, I've dropped something, yeah. So it comes with a loofah, then it also comes with the almond milk and honey uh, shower cream the uh, scrub and the body butter. And this line, the almond milk and honey, is it almond milk? Yeah, almond milk and honey is one of my favorites. I feel like a lot of people don't talk about it, but it's really softening, really, really hydrating, has a nice light scent. And like I said, the box is gorgeous. You don't even need to wrap it, but it's easily recyclable, which I always appreciate. So I think they did a really, really good job. And like, I'm only scraping the surface on the body shop offerings, but I really, uh, I really like this one. It's just so giftable. I forgot the other set that I wanted to mention from them that I wanted to highlight. This is one of my favorite lines. This was actually my first ever kind of foray into cleansing butter, cleansing balm. It would have been four or five years ago that I tried this one from the body shop. So it's the Sumptuous Cleansing Butter uh, with common chamomile extract and it's for suitable for sensitive skin. So this is a really, really good makeup remover. You use it on a dry face to remove all of your makeup. It comes with like the little muslin cloth uh, and then you go in with your cleanser and then it also includes the gentle eye makeup remover. I can't remember how I feel about that. I feel like I might have been on the fence, but either way, I absolutely love the cleansing butter. So this is kind of a nice twist because I mean, we can tend to 
give and gift a lot of like body and bubble baths and stuff and it's like do we really use all of that maybe not necessarily it depends but something like this I would absolutely love to see on the under the tree and it's good like if you have a makeup lover and you don't know what to get them because they have so much makeup they may just need a way to remove it so I think that this is really cute one of my favorite skincare brands is drunk elephant so I always love seeing their holiday sets they have a couple different ones so there's shelf respect which is this one here there's another one that's kind of like the inverse of this which has like their other kind of most popular products and then there's like a midi set which has some even more even more things in there these are not by any means super affordable but you know the brand is is a high-end brand and the um C Firma serum in here is probably one of my favorite vitamin C serums. It just, I felt like cleared up uh, any of the dullness on my skin, helped with dark spots, brightness, just really, really, I saw a true difference when using this. And same can be said for their TLC nighttime serum. I absolutely love that too. I've been trying to test out other stuff, but like, is really good and then also in here you're getting the deep bronzy sunshine drops which are very helpful for this time of year whether you want to mix it into your foundation or a moisturizer just to give yourself like a little bit of color and a little bit of oomph in the death of winter uh the hydration serum the polypeptide proteiny cream and then the spf 30 uh moisturizers in there so lots of great products i've yet to really try anything from drunk elephant that i didn't like and again i really like this uh packaging it is like a little kind of like a medicine cabinet I guess it's supposed to be and you open it up and it all looks really gorgeous. You can take out these plastic inserts so you can use this again uh, and it feels like a little bit more sturdy. Uh, would I 100% use it again? I don't know. I don't want to say that for sure um, but I do really really love the products inside here. Up next we have Sephora collection which I feel like can totally get overlooked. I love so many of their products. One of my favorite products that they do are the cream lip stains and they have some metallic ones this year which are really exciting. I think they actually have metallic all year round, but these are the uh, Cream Lip Shine Metals, both really, really beautiful, perfect holiday shades. And they're not like too metallic and glittery that it's like really in your face. It's just like a really beautiful finish. And I love the cream formula of these. They actually have a set that includes like their original formula in like a set, which I think is an awesome idea. Uh, and then if you're into a more traditional lipstick, they have these, uh, what are they called? The Lip Stories. And I love these. I have these in a lot, uh, not a lot. I think I have three shades of these, like a kind of a brown one, an orange one. But they're really nice lipsticks and they have really gorgeous packaging they're kind of more um I guess wintry than they are Christmassy which I think is really cute I'm going to include this in the giveaway as well because lord knows I don't need any more lipsticks uh they have tons of stuff similar to like body shop and stuff they come out with so many things uh this is a really cute little mask so you have a freezing mask which is supposed to be um like a high like one of those nice hydrogel masks and then the peeling mask which is supposed to be microfiber which i've never tried a microfiber mask i don't think uh they're both for the face this one has fruits fruit acids in it so really cute uh little set it's only ten dollars american twelve dollars canadian and then this what i saw it i was kind of like hmm, i don't know about this it looks like a little bit like it's an advent calendar but it, I, when i looked inside i was like oh there's actually a lot of really good stuff in here so you're getting like no strip the pineapple mask some shower gel jellies, uh, bath bombs, lip mask, lipsticks, liquid lipsticks, lip balm. So it doesn't feel like it's just a ton of crap thrown inside of it. The only things I think that aren't great are the two little pencils. They look like that really traditional kind of dry style of lip pencil, which I don't really love. But anyways, everything else in here looks really, really cute. And this one... And this one, I'm not sure how much it retails for, but everything I will uh, link to down below as long as it's still available online. If you're familiar with L'Occitane, they make some absolutely beautiful bath and body products. I'd say their most popular product is their almond shower oil, which I discovered last year and fell in love with. So I thought that this was a really cute little set. It comes in like a little Christmas ball and in here you're getting uh, a mini of the shower oil, which would be perfect for travel. Uh, the, sh the Delicious Hands Almond um, Hand and nail care and then also the milk concentrate so really really cute a little kind of sweet essentials and then something else that's new from them uh it's it is holiday but it has a shower foam in here and i feel like shower foams i don't know 
if it's like a fairly new thing or if they've been like around for a while but either way i'm enjoying all the shower foams and this kit is really cute uh it's got four different products in here i absolutely love the scent of everything so this has the uh, festive garden shower foam so these are all like holiday exclusive then you're also getting in here the ultra light cream which is really light and but still very very hydrating you're getting a mini of the little hand cream which i think is super cute uh, and then you're also getting the eau de the eau de toilette which is nice so if you actually really like the scent of this you can actually what is that high pitch noise you can also wear it as a scent which i think is super fun and again really gorgeous kind of packaging it looks holiday-ish and fun but not like too overdone so yeah that is everything from me when it comes to holiday gifts like i said tomorrow we will be kicking off the 12 days of foundation which is super exciting but don't forget to enter the giveaway down below and if you'd like to connect with me you can find me on instagram twitter and facebook at samantha jane yt and i'll see you guys next time bye